Sagittarius, come on in, put your feet up, make yourselves at home. I'm Richard Dawson, welcome to the TV. All right, Sag, I'm actually really excited about this one. I was meditating on your words, that, that I, I, I don't know, for your reading. And uh, <laughs> Secret Admirer came up. I'm like, what? Secret Admirer? I'm in. I want to know all about it. Who are they? Let's freaking go. All right, Sagittarius, who's your secret admirer? Freaking excited here. Right. Bear in mind, my loves, these are general readers, so it's not going to resonate with all of you. I really hope it does. Oh, I'm dropping my cards. But if it does, take a look in the description box below. There's a link to my Patreon if you want to watch extended videos. There's also a link to my website if you want to book a private reading. I don't think I've been this excited about a reading. Like, ages. I just there meditating like mm, Sagittarius. That's my cat coming from the through the kitchen window. Are you all right, Gary? Beep beep. I wouldn't be this like, excited about reading. I don't know. I thought that's what I was saying anyway. Secret admirer. Secret admirer. Let's have a look. Sagittarius is secret admirer. Let's have a look. Ten of Cups, Temperance, Ace of Pentacles, The Fool. Oh my god, I love this reading! Okay. Let's not give it much away though, so who they are. This is this is amazing. All right, so the overall vibe of the reading is the Ten of Cups. Warning from the universe, take it slow, mate. Take it slow, don't rush this. Come on, who are they? They're afraid to tell you. They're afraid. Who are they? What's their sign? Who are they? Um, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, a little bit younger than you, mm, you're friends on social media, mm, could be Aries, Leo, Sag, could be have you been with them before? Have you been in a relationship with them before? No, I don't think so. No, no you haven't. They've never told you how they feel. Um, have you met this person physically? So you know them on social media. Have you actually met this person physically before? Nope. Uh, okay. They're really into you. Why, why is this Ace of Pentacles here for what you need to know right now? This is like manifesting. I think you or them, both of you maybe even manifested each other. You uh, stop being afraid of what, what could be and let it go. And, and the universe is like, all right, you're not afraid anymore. Let's go for it. Oh, this is your one. This is amazing. This is your one. This is uh, this is your everything you've been looking for in a person. Everything that you feel like you desire and want in a relationship. That's that's what this person is. What's the challenge here? What's the challenge here? What time is it? Okay, we're good. What's the challenge here? I just have to do school pickup. The challenge here is boundaries. I'm kind of getting that a little bit later on, like, uh, also temperance, this could be your one, like, the, I feel like it is, but you gotta take your time and don't rush it, you gotta set some boundaries and not, and, and mean these boundaries, not crossing, no, nobody gets to mess with the boundaries, the universe is saying, yes, take your time with it, but go for it. Wee! Love! Yay! They 
they're stable, secure, abundant, they got a good job, pretty tidy, that's good. Uh, they might live a little distance from you. Why is the Page of Cups in reverse here? Um, I feel like they ha perhaps haven't spoken to you in a little while because they were sort of feeling a little bit um, self-conscious. They didn't want to stir up a hornet's nest. It sort of feels like they, they, they didn't want to... We've got the tower in reverse. It's like they, they didn't want it to be a disaster and to like, lose your friendship. So they're like, okay, I'll just not say anything. I'll just say, oh, there's a... But this person's... It's coming up. All right, let's have a look. Why is the Queen of Cups here in reverse? This is about... Uh, this is sort of the best you can hope for. That's kind of emotional insecurity. Uh, somebody perhaps who's... Gets themselves into unhealthy relationships. It's, it's kind of saying that that's sort of what your pattern has been and uh, that's that's going to change now. The best you can hope for is that you're not going to be in that unhealthy relationship pattern anymore, which is good. Just wait. You're going to see somebody in a different light. I'm getting that with the hangman here. You, it's like seeing things from a different perspective. You're gonna sort of like suddenly notice this person. Like, I've never noticed the line of their jaw before. I've never noticed their shapely calf. That butt looks really great in the in the garmentry they're wearing today. Damn, they've got a perfect nose. Maybe it's not a perfect nose, but suddenly you sort of notice that it is to you. Something feels all gooey inside of you and they smile and look at you. What's that all about? Oh my God, I think I'm falling for this person. You're going to start seeing things from a new perspective. What about them? They've been quite detached. It's been difficult for them to actually stay detached. They've, 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 they've missed you. So we've got the world for the outcome. Let's take a look. Why is the world here? The world's like a completion of a cycle. So you, you come in full circle and now you're going to be happy. Awesome. Yep. Stable, secure. There's loyalty here, things moving forward. Why is the... What's the conflict about? Uh, the conflict isn't with them, it's with someone else. Somebody who's jealous. Who? Next. Maybe yours, maybe theirs, maybe theirs. I, I sort of felt more of a ting when I said theirs. It's somebody that they're, they've been involved with. There's some conflict here. Perhaps someone who you know, you might have somebody in common, a friend, and they're not going to be happy about it. They're not going to be happy about this relationship. Tell me more. Are we going to cause trouble? They can't really. I can't really cause trouble because this is your four of wands, baby. Don't worry about him. It's just a minor hiccup. You're flying the soup. More protein. Let's take a look. I want to ask in the extended... When are they coming towards you? When are they going to talk to you? When are they going to reveal themselves to you? Uh, how do they feel about you? Let's look a bit more into who they are, uh, what they want to say to you, what their intentions are towards you, some guys from the universe. Let's have a look. I'm excited about this one. Have faith in your dreams. Wee! 
and your love song for the day is I've been quick about this reading for some reason. I'm too excited. I can't hold it in. I'm not one of those readers that can draw it out for an hour. <laughs> I'm too excited. Love Bites by Def Leppard. I don't want to be there when you decide to break it. Total tune. Anyway. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. And if you want to watch Extended, take a look in the description box below. There's a link to my Patreon. You'll find the video there.